February 17th. Rehearsal, Beauty and the Beast. Jackson Liberty High School. See you later. <laughs>gig vlog 87 the new uh, question that i've been asking everybody is um if i was in the musical what character would i be oh that's a good one i'm gonna go with chip welcome to the gig vlog Yay. um the new question is if i was in the musical what character would i be oh i don't know it's your dark oh that would be a good one who is it what do, what do they do I don't even know. He's the owner of the insane asylum. Uh, okay, I'll take that. <laughs> it's better than Chip. Listen, you make it.
Um, I could see you as doing the voiceover for everybody. So instead of any of them singing or anything, it would just be you singing. So like, you might not be seen, but you would be heard for sure. So welcome to the gig vlog. I think this is your first official appearance. Yes, this definitely um, is. So if I was in the musical, what character would I be? Um, well, I'll go with Chip. Chip, definitely no, Chip. No, no, no. <laughs> Adam, you're next. If I was in the musical, what character am I best uh, born for? You? Yes. Take it. No, this musical. Oh. Uh, ooh. I, I still say Tigger. I think LeFou. You've got good facial expressions. Welcome to the gig vlog, um, your first official appearance. Um, if I was in the musical, not that you know me well at all, which character do you think I best would be? Gaston. Yes! 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 My new favorite horn player. All right, I'm Mike. We just met. What's your name? Leah. Leah, hi. Um, if I was in the musical, what character would I be best for? Oh, um, I'll give you Gaston. Yes, two in a row! Yeah. Friday, tired. Opening night was last night, and it was good. Very nice show, nice and clean. I always love the live crowds. Um, but yeah, today's the Friday night show, and every day is a gift. Each day is a gift. Shout out to all my Costco Manahawken enjoyers out there. Here we are, Beauty and the Beast. One of us is the beauty, one of us is the beast. What do you think? Um, I'll be the beast today. Oh no. Um, if I was in the musical, which uh, character would I be? Um, I don't know, you could be Gaston. Yes, just stop there, thank you. Okay. Perfect, thank you. Here's Harry, the uh, man behind the curtain. The, uh, this is your first official appearance on the gig vlog. Um, the question I ask is- I feel honored. You are, you should be. Yeah. Um, <laughs> if I was in the musical, what role do you think I should be? Oh, dude, you would probably be LeFou. LeFou? I'm feeling LeFou, yeah. I mean, that or Gaston. Gaston, I'll take Gaston, you thank Gaston? you. You Gaston? Yeah, let's I, that I feel like I feel like you could probably pull Gaston off. But LeFou's just like comic relief. And, you know, well, I guess. The comic. But you could probably jack up and play. And you wouldn't even need, like, prosthetics or anything. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, no problem. Is this wise is about to sleep. No, I, I jump. I'm here with the, the man, the myth, the legend, uh, Scott Katona, director of uh, Jackson Liberty High School Music uh, Program here. Excited to be here. This is Mike's, like, I don't know. 16. Oh, I was going to say 60th, but 16. Close 60th enough. Year. Who's yep. counting? Who's I've, to say? I've worked with this uh, maestro for, I think, eight of those years. Eight magical years on the drum set, and with perfect timing, precision, he's the man. Perfect. He's, he's the man. Here. Now, in Beauty and the Beast, if I was one, if I was one of the characters, who would I be? Oh, well, I mean, you're a beast at the drums, so okay. I would say you're the beast, right. but yet you're delicate and sweet like Bell on the drums, so I, I don't know, that's, that's a tough one. I, I have played the bells before. That's right, yeah, that's true, that's true. <laughs> All right, thank you, Mr. Katona. Adios.
so it's been uh, pretty helpful today. Um, Jim needed a belt, so I got a belt for Jim. Uh, so I actually got him two belts, and he could pick which one was better. And then Rob needed some uh, remote tech support, audio tech support, so I gave it to him. We uh, linked up on a Zoom, and that was that. It was nice thing Scott though. How long must this scene go on? So my new theory, my new theory is uh, Lumiere and Cogsworth are a split personality of Sebastian. Because Sebastian, that's right, was uh, equal parts flamboyant on stage, but he was like a taskmaster chasing after Ariel. And that's Cogsworth and Lumiere. I figured it out, I solved it. Ryan, what's wrong with your card? <laughs> I don't know. She's gonna have to ring up the next one. Alright, that's fine. <laughs> now I'm gonna try the other uh, automated one. <laughs> Alright, we're in the West Wing. Here is the magical rose. The enchanted rose. Does she love me? Does she love me not? The West Wing. So I'd like to offer a correction. Apparently it's my 18th year, not my 16th year. I can't do math, I guess that's why I came in early tonight. <laughs> um, thank you, Kylie. Thank you, Veronica, for hiring me. It's always a pleasure to play uh, drums for Jackson Liberty High School. Jackson Liberty High School, I can't speak. It's cold, it's 30 degrees. Um, I know the next two shows, I'm not telling. Um, saw a friend from high school tonight, that was nice. Uh, it's always fun playing with uh, Adam, Susanna, Becky, Brian. It's great. Meet some new uh, horn friends. That's always nice. Um, I guess that's it. I like playing music for uh, kids, for people. It's nice. Thanks, Dad. Bye, everybody.